I feel like, like this mandate to bring the kingdom to the capital, it's, it's, it's such a, a, I mean, the logistics, the, we had to read millions of dollars, you know, the, the permits we have to secure, all this kind of stuff. And it all, it all culminates nine days before the presidential election on the National Mall wow. in D.C., October 26th. We're going to be gathered there on the National Mall having the biggest Jesus party in America while the whole world's freaking out about the elections, right? That, that's, that's my heart, is that we culminate there, but we have 23 states left to go, and a lot of those are the purple states, the swing states. You know, we'll be going into Pennsylvania uh, the last week, you know, Fina, uh, Arizona, uh, North Carolina, Michigan, you know, these places that are key, that are pivotal. Um, but what we're seeing is, is thousands of people coming out. It's not about red or blue, it's about purple, it's about the king and his kingdom, and it's basically saying, God, we want to enthrone you over every U.S. capital, over this building that's legislatively important for the state, setting the laws for the whole state. We're saying, you are the king, you are the Lord, let the government be on your shoulders, and it's been really powerful.